Another day, another vlog, and I've left the confines, the safety of the Simra today to come to a park which exists in the real world, which is a bit confusing for me. But yeah, summer's here, the weather's hot today, it's 30 degrees, and thinking about stuff that I want to do in terms of racing, definitely want to be doing more karting, for sure. Um, going down to Sunland Park, trying to get that mythical 49 second lap for me. I'll probably need to lose some weight to do that, which is a good thing for me to aim for. And also Club 100, I've got quite a few Club 100 races coming up um, in the next few months, which is great for the summer. My hand isn't quite recovered yet, but um, after the 24 hours at Daytona, but give it a week or so, I reckon I'll be back to full strength. I've tried to do a few sim races and it hasn't really held up yet. I can feel the skin moving around, which isn't a nice feeling. So going to give that a few more days a week to come back and I'll be hitting sim racing hard. On the sim racing side, I racing an obscene amount of 24 hour races coming up, which is really good fun. And I want to be hitting those as well. I want to be pushing myself in those ones. I want to be doing longer stints. Can I do a four hour stint? Can I do a six hour stint in an I racing 24 hours? Um, you know, some classic tracks there, going to Le Mans, going to Monza, going to Circuit of the Americas, so that's going to be really exciting. I racing is, is huge right now. And yeah, between the eye racing and the karting, Juicy Sport. Yo, that one there was a violation, personally I wouldn't have it. Just not massively feeling GT Sport right now. Let me know in the comments if you're feeling the same, but GT Sport just feels a little bit samey. And when you compare it against iRacing, iRacing is just so much more. So, but let me know, do you feel the same way? Or is GT Sport more fun to watch? Let me know because I am making the content for you guys. It's got to be entertaining, got to be fun to watch. And if you guys prefer GT Sport, then it's useful for me to know and I can hit that hard as well. But I do want to be doing the iRacing more. I think it will make me a better driver as well. In terms of other racing stuff, might be doing some other series in, in carts, we will see. I'm going to be going up to PFI to do a special six hour race with Russ Ward and some people like that you'll recognise from the channel, which will be good fun. And maybe some other sim racing as well. If F1 2021 is going to come out, I want to hit that hard. And the key to all of this on the sim racing side, I think it's time for me now to get a proper rig. The play seat challenge has, has run its course. Um, I think the flex and the pedals and the wheelbase, you can see it sometimes on the videos, are just a little bit too much and I want to have that consistency with the pedals and really work on my braking. So yeah, a little channel update for you, another, another vlog. Always fun to do a vlog, get out in the real world. Hopefully you like it, let me know as well in the comments if you like the vlogs or not. Always really useful to know, but I do want to push the content. Big thanks as always to anyone who likes, subscribes. Anyone who's a member, you guys and girls are the MVPs, that's the reason why I've got this camera. But yeah, hope you enjoy it and I'll see you next time.